see anyone else in the area of the ballroom? No one. You went to the stables to get Ms. Weber. Did you pass anyone in the corridor on your way back? Now, what about Mr. Cassidy? Any reason you know that he'd want to hurt his fiance? Nicholas would never hurt Emily. It was Anthony Zakara. He stabbed Rick Lansing. He dragged me up to the turret and threatened to throw me off. You only had to listen to the man ramble to know that he was insane. What exactly did Zakara say? He made Jason get up on the wall with me and told him that if he didn't jump, he was going to push me off. How did Zakara get from there to the courtyard with two bullets in him? He pulled a gun on us. Jason shot him. It was self-defense. Did the impact push him back over the turret wall? No, he jumped. I'm telling you, the man was crazy. That doesn't mean he killed Miss Quarterman. Look, you said you and Mr. Morgan were the first ones to reach the ballroom. Did you arrive at the same time? Was one of you a couple steps ahead of the other? I got here first. Did you see any sign of Anthony Zakara? All I saw was Nicholas holding my dead sister. Where is Mr. Cassidy now? I'm gonna take the body. They'll want to do an autopsy. No, it shouldn't matter what they do with her now. She's not even Emily anymore. She's gone. But I don't want them to touch her. your dreams had come true. All the way back to high school when you had a crush on him. And you kept looking for help when there really wasn't much. And you would say to me, Elizabeth, is, is he looking at me? Did he notice me? Nicholas just said, how are you? What do you think that meant? You said it wasn't what he said, it was the way he said it. And I tried to let you down easy, but... <laughs> in the end, you were right. Nicholas fell hopelessly in love with you. You trusted your heart, and it paid off. It's a big lesson for me. Bucky's missing, and I thought he'd be in here. Well, I haven't seen him. Maybe you should go tell Mac. Tell him what exactly, Elizabeth? That that Detective Spencer is on a free fall because he just found out that his baby son isn't his? Yeah, that sounds like a really good idea. Humiliate him just a little I'm bit more. I'm not going to do this. I'm not going to stand here on my best friend's body and argue with you. You are such a bitch! Lucky loved Emily, too, and he is going to be devastated when he finds out that she's been killed. Has that ever occurred to you? Emily, Lucky, Nicholas, and I, we were all best friends. Not that you would know anything about that. Oh, no, of course not. Best friend. Was it worth trashing Lucky and all those years of friendship just so you could go chasing after Jason? Get, get the hell away from her! 
Wait, how, how could you leave these people alone with her? You're not taking her away from me. You understand me? Mr. Cassidyne, I, I'm very sorry for your loss, but this is a murder investigation. I don't care about your murder. Yeah, get out of my house. Just get out of here. Leave us alone. Em, hi. It's your mother. I'm calling because I want to know everything about last night. I haven't heard from you, and I'm dying to know how the party went. So, when you get this message, when you, when you get this, um, give me a call, okay? Love you. Something's happened. Is Emily all right? Emily died last night. What? She was uh, strangled early this morning at Windermere and Nicholas found her. No, 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 Jason. No, that is a mistake. The police think a man named Anthony Zakara did it. Who? Anthony Zakara. I've read about him. He's a... He's a g gangster, isn't he? I mean, is he... Is he one of your friends? I'd never met him before. Oh, but I'm sure... I'm sure he was anxious to meet you. Oh, my. You know something? I... I spent every day with blood on my hands, trying to save a life. When was the last time you saved a life, Jason? My God, Emily worshipped you. And you are nothing but a killer, because you killed her. You know, let me get you someone who can... Who? Who, Jason? They're all dead. AJ? Alan, who oh, you were too busy killing to even go and say goodbye to. My God, not, not Emily. Oh, my God. I'm sorry. Get out of here. Get out. You are the only thing I have left, and I don't want you. Get out. And don't you dare think about coming to her funeral, don't you? There, show your face around here. Get out! You are not my son. You are. Oh my God. Thank you. 